Hello, it's February 5th, 2020, and here's your daily dose of IntroWeb 17. We're still continuing to make fantastic progress on the designer. Yesterday we released a short video showing how you can move buttons around, but that wasn't fully functional. Not just buttons, any control. I can pick up the chart and I can move it. And right now we don't quite have the live preview. You wouldn't think that adds a lot of complication, but it does. So we're going to bring that back someday, but right now it's still pretty visible. You can see what you're moving. You just don't get a full live preview of it. Now this is a typical fixed layout, similar to what you use in, in an a VCL application or uh, WinForms where you put it and it stays exactly where you want it. But there are other layouts which we talked about earlier. For example, these three things right here. There's a text and a checkbox and a button. They're not positioned that way. They're actually inside of a layout. So you can see the little gray border on the outside that runs up. See just above my mouse here? That's a layout. So the inner border is a control. The outer border is a cell. And then this other square you see coming up is the layout. And you can see it happens here too when we hover over this button. You'll see a big gray around the whole thing here. Okay? And that's why there's three lines whether I hover or whether I select. Now what's really cool is if I take this button, I select it to move it, and I can move it around just like I did before. But if I want to move it into another layout, and this layout actually exists inside of the fixed panel. So I can move it as a layout too, and everything inside it moves with it. But let's say that I want to put something into it. Now, of course, I can drag and drop from over here, but let's take something that's here and I want to move it here. I can just move it up and drag it where I want it. See? And now button one is inside of those ones. Now, if I want to move it further, I can drag it and drop it. I can move it up or down just like here, but I can also use these buttons, which make it really easy to move things up and down. A uh, small bug with the selection there, but you can see it, it is moving things. It's just not moving the right thing. So small buglet there, but that's what happens when you're in the middle of development. But I can take, and this is, for instance, three, which was always inside. And I can take it, and I can drag it outside, and now it's on the fixed layout instead. Or I can take this checkbox and do the same thing. And so that's it for today. Thanks.